Imagine you have a database containing thousands, maybe millions of medical patients. Each data set with attributes such as the patient's height, weight, whether or not the patient has been diagnosed with a particular disease, etc. A new patient comes in and to get a hint of how a particular treatment would turn out, we may want to compare the previous cases with similar patients. Let's say we want to search a database for people between uh, 70 and 80 kilos, between 170 and 180 centimeters, and who have been diagnosed with, let's say, some kind of heart problem. How can we, in an efficient way, search for all patients within this multidimensional range? We cannot possibly go through all elements in the database every time we want to make a search. We therefore need to have a data structured in an ordered way to speed things up. But how do we order multidimensional data? The answer is a data structure called KD tree or K-dimensional tree. So, how do we build such a data structure? Imagine that we have a space with a number of points. We start with finding the median of the point's x values and split the set into two different branches. In each branch, we will now find the median along the y axis and divide into branches once again. We will continue like this, alternating between splitting along the x and y axis until each cell only contains one point. We now have our finished tree structure. Now, how do we use this structure to find the points in a given range? Let's say we want to find all points between this and this x value and between this and this y value. We start by looking at the tree root. Since both branches intersect with the range, we need to continue searching along both branches. We now look at the second level and see that only the upper or right branch intersects with the range. We can thus discard the left branch. While continuing on the right or upper branch, we see that both branches intersect with the range. We then have to look at the actual points in each cell and see if it lays within the range. For our main right branch, we do the same thing. We look at the upper and lower branches and see if they intersect with the range, continuing along those that do intersect and discarding those who don't. When we reach a leaf, we look if the point lays within the range or not. And that is a final range search for multidimensional data.